Hi friends, I hope you liked the previous video on BOPP bags that we have made. Today I'm going to talk about non-woven bags. Non-woven bags my friends is also called as fabric bags. Normally, you know, the printers, the packaging guys say that this is a bag which is not environment friendly. I mean, I think PP bags are also not environment friendly because it does not degrade faster. But non-woven bags is one of the most beautiful bags that you can see in the market. It looks like a cloth, it has a matte finish, the pictures and printing on it is amazing. So let's find out a little more details on to what goes into a non-woven packaging and what kind of products go into it. So because your non woven bags is roughly around say say 20 rupees a kg sorry 20 rupees per bag of a 25 kg bag uh, because the design and printing is so very great on this it's not a very high priced uh, bag um, in terms of minimum order quantity also it is very friendly that way you can even print like a thousand bags or just one container worth of bags or two thousand bags also right so this is one of the you know like people who want to go for BOPP should first I think go into non-woven bags you know experiment their brand and packaging and then slowly move into BOPP when your volumes have picked up. So that way non-woven bags you know it, it gives you that flexibility. So we've talked about uh, price range uh, for a 25 kg bag roughly around 20 to 25 rupees. You know, minimum order quantity we have talked about. You can, you can even print 1000 bags or 2000 bags. Th there is no major cost of cylinders because cylinders are not used in this kind of bags. The plates are used in these bags and it is very easily um, made in about two, 3000 rupees, uh, you know, particular plate uh, for the, which the designs are made, right? What kind of rice? I mean, any rice can go into this, uh, you know, Sona Masuri rice, RNR, steam, kolam, any kind of rice. You can go into it where you want to showcase that the brand gets a bit of premium look as well. So that is one advantage of uh, non-woven bags, right? Right. No, normally, Middle East markets loves, the, uh, you know, non-woven bags. Uh, Singapore market loves non-woven bags. Uh, US uh, as a market loves non-woven bags. Canada as a market loves non-woven bags. If there is any risk with the non-woven bags, that's only one. Because these bags are like a cloth material, in the event that it comes in contact with water, might be water seepage you know, in your uh, area or might be say due to rain or in, during transit, water seepage into the truck or container, that is when this bag would easily absorb the water and the water will easily penetrate into the bags which in the case of PP and BOPP it actually tries and avoids water coming in because the bag is closely knit it's a woven bag and it is a laminated bag so it, to a large extent it tries to you know kind of not allow the water to seep in right a lot of people also try to prefer to put a plastic liner inside a non-woven bags just for the purpose of this safety right this is all about non-woven bags my friends which is also called as a fabric bag double side printing and handles and a lot of things can be experimented on this i hope you've liked this video i'm going to come with more videos based on price exports and everything else soon thank you